So she just barked the entire time. The entire time. All right, so Zuri is about eight weeks old. Um, so that means that she needs to get some puppy vaccines. Um, so we are on our way to the vet for her vet, first vet appointment. And of course, um, I had her strapped into her like seat belt for the car for about five seconds. Um, and I decided to wear shorts today. So she jumped over on my legs, and <laughs> cut them up pretty bad. So we're doing really good right now. Of course, she is not loving any of this. She just wants to wander around. So we're gonna go get her her first set of vaccines. Yay! Um, Brandon right now is at work. Okay, so she just barked the entire time. The entire time. I think it's really funny that she already has so much like driving anxiety and this is her first time going to the vet. Like I don't know what's going on. So um, we're gonna take her in and hopefully I can video some of it. I might cry, you never know. Um, Cause she's probably gonna squeal, so. Um, we'll see how it goes. Okay, Mr. Beagle. Here comes a big old flea after you. Mm -hmm. Hold still. Oh my goodness. I know, sake. baby. There you go. Good girl. Good girl. We'll go over two weeks till she's 16 weeks. Okay. Is that it then? That's it for today. Okay. Hey, thank you. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Yeah, she's not feeling so hot. Um, so she's five and a half pounds. So that's exciting. And um, what they said was we have to give her this shot every two weeks until she's 16 weeks because she's eight weeks right now. So um, I asked him for like a record that way because we're moving in. Um, I'm we're, <laughs> The two of us are moving in like four days. That way, um, whenever I take her, I know she's tired. Um, whenever I take her to the vet up there, that way we know what the plan is. So, yeah, she's not very happy. And she's probably going to pass out later because she's just been crying this whole time. So, yep. So, I decided to bring her to daddy's work because she's really mad at me right now. She actually just peed on my phone and my wallet. So, yeah. Um, so, hopefully daddy can cheer her up. I know that they're really busy right now, so it might be a while, and that's okay, but she just, she really hates me right now. I mean, if I were in there, I would have told him to give her, like, that, the rabies shot. I would give her at least a couple of them. That way, you know, less traumatic. There she's shaking. Well, she's cold. I'm but cold, too. But she's, <laughs> yeah, she really hates me right now. Are you videotaping so. me right now? I don't know. <laughs> Seriously? I decided that we were going to bring her here because she really hated mom. So She really hated mom? <laughs> so she peed on all my stuff. Well, what did you expect? I don't know. Did <laughs> you take her out after the vet? No. Uh. I, just, I just put her in the car because I was like, she, she seriously, like, right after it happened, all she did was cry. And she's, like, doing her, her whole howl thing and everything. Go see dad. Okay, come here. Come here. It's Go all see right. dad. Okay. Okay. She's five and a half pounds. Five and a half. Five and a half. You're growing up. Look huh? at you. Yeah? And oh you... no, you're cold, honey. I'm sorry. What? Looking around? Huh? What are you looking around? Oh I know it's oh I know. I know. It's a lot of new stuff. It's just me. It's dad. Hey, look at me. Look at me. Oh. You done? She's, okay. I think she's scared by all the noises. Yeah. But she's over it. She yes. literally, you can tell, she peed, she peed right there. Yeah. And like on my wallet. Oh. My phone was sitting here. You should have moved everything. I mean. Well, I just wanted to get her out of there. And she wasn't like, all she was, I don't know. She wasn't reacting good to anything except when she was on my lap. So I didn't really expect her to like move over there. 
Hi, honey. Well, I need to get back to work. I have, I'm actually pretty busy right now, so. I asked him if you were busy, and he was like, no, well, I'll go grab him really quick. I, okay. I yeah, I got stuff going on. I'm trying to get Robert out of here and everything else, so. <laughs> She's upset because Dad is gone. She's like, damn it. <laughs> it's okay. He'll come home later. But she definitely calmed down whenever um, she saw him, so. Um, Brandon was saying something about how if he were there he would have had them give more than just the one shot um, but honestly that's all they recommended and I trust that's here more than I would probably a lot of other places so that's probably what we're gonna do just keep hopefully in Ames we can find um, a good vet uh, if you guys have any suggestions that would be amazing but um yeah i we'll see how it goes maybe we'll have to go to des moines or something which wouldn't be a big deal because it's only like 30 minutes away um and also i'll probably have to go there pretty much every single day anyways because ankeny where my school is it's like a it's like a northern suburb of des moines so not a big deal my sister's dog hermes um she says that she really likes the the vets down here compared to up there so that makes me a little worried because i i'm probably going to be pretty picky <laughs> but yeah so now we're just going to go home and i'm going to edit this video and i'm going to be really nice to her all day she's probably going to nap because she's had a lot of like, excitement <laughs> for the past like 30 minutes so yeah um, i don't know if i talked about this at all but you guys know that um she hates car rides um, so I actually did talk to the people there. I was like, hey, so we're going to be moving soon. And she hates them. All she does is howl the entire time. Um, and I asked if there's anything that like we give her. And they said no. <laughs> Nothing for a pup or that small. They were like, I'd probably kennel her. And um, I would, which I was planning to do anyways. That way I didn't have any distractions while I was driving. And then they also said that you should probably pull her food in the morning if it's going to be a morning trip um, because otherwise she might throw up. That morning is going to be interesting and my guess is that she's probably going to bark for at least an hour. Um, so I'll probably have to take some ibuprofen before we leave. Uh, from there it'll go, um, hopefully she'll just pass out. I hate that she doesn't like car rides, especially since we're moving soon. So really kind of stinks. If you like our videos, go ahead and subscribe and uh, we'll see you next time. Bye.